There we go. Whoops. Gotta do this thing. I figure we do um, Retribution and Storm Rising. I already did uh, Uprising before you joined. But if you still want to do that, uh, I'm cool with that. Just give me a heads up in the chat if you can. Alright. Yeah, I tried joining twice, uh, but there's that one guy that just doesn't want to pick a character. <laughs> I blocked them, so hopefully we won't have to encounter them. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's pretty much the good thing I like about the avoid uh, as teammate thing. If they give you any problems, what's the point in having them with you, you know? Absolutely. I, uh, I've been running this guy for months. His name is Necrotic Maw. Whenever I'm not on his team, he try hard. But whenever he's on my team, he goes Winston and he just doesn't play. He just sits there. Oh, no. And then when we do Storm Rising, I mean, I know it's the all-hero thing, but I was thinking of going Winston in there. Yeah. And then, um, yeah, I was going to say, last time I was on that map, it was just skirmish, but I was spamming Mountain Gorillas Thrive in Colder Climates, and uh, I actually killed a couple of Widows. Yeah, that always seems to happen to me, too, sometimes. I'm gonna shoot a heal here just in case. And I can't talk about the miscalculation anymore. I, I said it like five times and it's waiting to load. Nice one. We just eye hook them, we just boop them, they just die. Yeah. See if you can do that with the sniper when uh, she appears. Oh, I find. Yeah. Usually what I like to do is, if I'm Genji, I'll just reflect the bullet back to her, but if I'm Cassidy, I love using my ultimate on him. Because it takes a long time to attack. I wonder what it's like. Uh, the big guy. Ah, uh, that's, that's good. The Reinhardt combined with the Bastion. Because he pretty much has those two miniguns as hands. Uh -huh. Approaching escape velocity. Reduce your expectations to zero. Like Newton and the Apple. Hey there. Farewell. Reach it up. Yes. <laughs> I love how I'm just like goodbye to the echo and she's like, yes. Looks like I'm gonna be your ride out of here. Heading to the extraction point. Look for the art gallery. I'll meet you there. That's the only thing I don't like about the um, unlimited hero thing in this thing. Like, the pilot sounds so awkward. Can I have one in the water? Oh no! I got gotcha. you! Oh, I'm being duplicated. Oh, that's the where the sniper is. Nice one. Alright, alright, I gotta save this I'm gonna see if I can save That's fine. I was gonna say I have my ultimate. I wanna wait till um 
the assassin comes. I'll just send her flying up into the air and then won't bother anyone. <laughs> oh my god, the three shotgun dudes are here. Oh my god, hello? And oh, goodbye. There she is, there she is. Here. I hear her. I... Fuck, where is she? Oh. Did I get her? No, damn it. If I could hit her with the big boulder, though, that, no. She stuck on the little pillar and she jumped on Yeah. I can't walk on. Ah, this is just good timing on Baptiste's part. They're behind us as well. Yeah, I don't have my ultimate though. Oh, that goes copying you now. Aha, I hit her with a big rock. You just rocked her and kept her fucking good. There was two blocks. That, that's a field cap. Nice. Hang to the evac point in the courtyard up ahead. The calculation should have been correct. The calculation should have been correct. I'm entering Venice airspace now. Headed toward your position. I wonder, I remember um, in the earlier versions, if you if you hit the ship, it would be damaged. But for some reason, they got rid of that a few years ago. They should have brought that... They should, they should have kept that. I thought that would have been... A lot of fun. Ah, uh, Digo beat me to it. Escape velocity. Now I have the perfect voice line for when the ship comes to pick us up. Approaching escape velocity. <laughs> that one's pretty funny too. Or the pilot comes like ask if she wants candy. Be like, thank you for picking us up. Want some candy? Want some candy? <laughs> Uh, matching all the oh, oh yeah. The assassin approaches. The assassin approaches. I took care of her. We broke her, I think. That was yeah, I was gonna say when you hooked her before she could do anything. You're a genius. Holy There's a sniper among us. Ah, he said among us. Oh, hey. Now I just got to find out who has the tomato sauce. You know, I tried telling that, that joke to my cousins, but they didn't realize, you know, I was like, no, that's not what it is, it's sus, it's short for suspicious, and the... I jumped it. Approaching escape velocity. 
Approaching escape velocity. <laughs> Easy as pie. Yeah. You know, those other difficulties, they don't call it hard for nothing, because it's also hard to find other people that want to do it. Wait, wait, what the... Wasn't this medium? Yeah. Normal. Oh. Yeah, for some reason, they don't call it easy. So the next you, one is hard? <laughs> yeah. Looks like I got another loot box. You know, I did have like 425 of those. I still have 100. For real? Yeah. <laughs> ah. I, too much. I was gonna say, at least you're not buying them with real money. And like, what's the point in doing that if you can just get them for free? Pretty much, you level up once, get one, and then every week you get like three for free. Yeah, that's. Pretty much it. I got a new forest skin. And some money. Alright, time to go get Maximilian. Oh, yes. Yeah, so normal, hard, expert, and legendary. Yeah, Whatever happened to easy, medium, and hard? There's no such thing. I remember that used to be the case in a lot of video games I had. Um, for my PS2, I, which I still have most of them. There's one I have to get, and then I'll have all the games I used to have when I was a kid. Cart Fury. Cart Fury? Yeah, it was pretty much open wheel race cars. Kind of like what they have in the Indy uh, 500 or... I guess you could also say Formula One. Oh, I see. It's the uh, arcade machine. More or less. That was literally the very first video game I ever played when I was like four years old. And I always liked the way the announcer sounded. Like when you selected the difficulty, you'd be like, easy, automatic. The first one I ever played was Jurassic uh, Park. A video game for a PS2. I remember an older version for the Super NES. Now, I never actually had that console myself, but I my cousin did. Um, but when I played that game, that was actually something one of my friends had in Maryland. The only game that I played on my cousin's Super NES was a uh, Battleship. Battleship, like, like the guess my location and you sunk my battleship. Battleship. Yeah, that's the one, and it was actually pretty good. 